Welcome to my channel. My name is Talentia, and I'm your mom who's trying to get her family to financial freedom. I work two part-time jobs. I am still working on trying to come up with a plan for my side hustles to increase my income. But as of now, nothing really in the works. Um, this week, we're going to go ahead and stuff our envelopes for our weekly expenses. But before we do that, I wanted to read this quote to you. Um, when you're out of willpower, you call on stubbornness. That's the trick. <laughs> uh, by Henry Matisse. I'll go ahead and display that on the screen, hopefully. Um, but I've been kind of, you know, in an awkward, weird place. And as, um, you know, as you get older, your thoughts change, your ambition changes, your goals change. What is important, what you valued, you know, years ago is not the same today. So um, my main priority in my life is just to be available for my family. And it has been that way, I think, since my late 30s. Um, for those of you who don't know, 42 here. <laughs> so proud of it. Um, glad to have reached 42. Not that there's been anything in my life that may have put me in a position where I wouldn't have thought, oh, I'd never see 42. Because in my head, I'm going to die at 120. I'm going to see my grandbabies, grandbabies, <laughs> grandbabies, you know? So anyway, um, but I do get to a point where, especially when you're dealing with finances and work and trying to figure that balance out, I get um, a little bit discouraged and I'm like, okay, well, how do I, you know, reignite that willpower to keep going to say, okay, well, this is enough. This is plenty. I don't need to overdo anything. How do I get to that place where doing enough, just enough is suffice. And I will get discouraged and say, oh, I have to go above and beyond. I have to do all these wild, crazy things, which is not the case. So I'm rambling to you <laughs> because, um, you know, there's thoughts in my head and I'm pretty sure other people are struggling with the willpower um, to stay focused, to um, accomplish goals, things like that. So what I'm saying to you is what I'm telling myself, call on stubbornness because, I mean, it's one of my greatest attributes. I feel like it doesn't always work out in my favor. Sometimes it causes a little uh, tiff, <laughs> um, you know, when you're dealing with other people. But when you're dealing with yourself, be a little bit stubborn and say, okay, I have to do this for these reasons. Remember your why. So anyway, now that we've done our TED Talk for today, let's go ahead and set up our envelopes. My kitty's right next to me. He's trying to jump up here, and I'm trying to convince him it's not a good idea. Don't, don't, don't do it, kitty. <laughs> he jumped the other way, but jumped nonetheless. Anyway, we're stuffing 20, 40, 60, 80. 1, 20, 40, 60. 70, 75, 80, 85, 90. We're stuffing 190 this week. So um, when you're seeing this, I'm actually stuffing my envelopes a little bit earlier because I am leaving to go out of town today uh, for my special birthday road trip that my mother has planned for us. Uh, my kiddos are going with me. So I wanted to make sure the money that's going into my envelope and the money that's going into my kiddos envelope, if we need it or we want it, we'll have it. So, um, yeah, but when you're seeing this, we should be, um, you know, back and trying to figure out why we spent all our money, our, all of our allowance on our trip, but <laughs> uh, we're going to go ahead and go for it anyway. All right. So mommy is getting 40 bucks, 20, 40. Gas is getting 20. I am going out of town, so for a few days I won't need gas. And so honestly, I did put some gas in my car, so I'm hoping that I'll have some some of it left. But, you know, if not, it's okay. Uh, we may need it for the other things. Uh, and some of these envelopes I'm actually leaving here because it makes sense to just leave here and I'll shop when I come back. Groceries getting 100, 20, 40, 60, 80, 100. Now, um... I haven't done my Walmart pickup. I'm trying to, as soon as I'm done recording, I'm going to try to get that done so my honey can go get groceries after work. Um, and I need to put that in my account to um, 
cover the the damage that's done on my card for groceries. Household, 10 bucks. Now this is the one one of the ones I'm leaving here because I'll get the things I need. Stop kitty <laughs> when I come back. So um, that one's staying and pets, 10 bucks into pets. So my kitty, uh, our kitty, he's not mine. He belongs to everyone. Uh, he wants to go outside, so I'm going to try to hurry up. But we're going to leave these here. And miscellaneous, this is my kiddo's allowance. They each get five bucks, Vincent and Victor. And um, they haven't earned this money, but I kind of feel like, eh, they can get a pass this week, you know. <laughs> we'll go ahead and give them their five bucks so they can go ahead and uh, spend it up on their on the road trip. So groceries, um, I'm going to take to the bank but the rest of these envelopes are actually staying here so i'm just going to go ahead and put these here and that's it you guys we we went ahead and stuffed our envelopes for our weekly expenses we're ready to get on the road ready to make sure that we're prepared for next week as well but that's it i want to thank you so much for watching please like share comment and subscribe all of the things that can keep us connected i look forward to seeing my next video Feel free to check out SNC Budget Creations. We're on Etsy and Instagram. I will link them down below. And yeah, that's it. Have a great day, guys. Bye.